Hi. Did you know you could do the equivalent of planting a tree by choosing what fuel you use in your car? I could plant six trees per year. I'll show you how. The story starts with corn ethanol. Since 2006, it's been mandated that fuel be blended with ethanol. Over 40% of our corn in the United States is used to produce ethanol. That's 40% of our most productive land being used to grow a low-grade fuel instead of food. That's 40% of the nutrient runoff into our watershed as an unnecessary cost to our environment. Anyway, back to how you can plant a tree by driving your car. There are some service stations that provide fuel that does not contain ethanol. Surprisingly, every station in the state of Iowa does, for instance. Also, it's interesting that although farmers are highly supportive of the ethanol mandate, they do not use any of this fuel in their own machine. I compared my mileage with ethanol blended and non-ethanol fuel. When I use ethanol fuel, mostly when I'm driving in Illinois, I get between 35 and 36 miles per gallon. When I'm able to, to fill with non-ethanol fuel, like driving through Iowa, I average over 40 miles per gallon. This is for my car. Every make of car is different in its engine and mechanics. I encourage you to try it out on your own car. Now to get to the tree part. If the primary focus of addressing climate change is to reduce our carbon footprint, your carbon footprint, an obvious step is to use less fuel. Burning one gallon of gasoline releases five and one half pounds of carbon into the air. I get more than a 10% increase in mileage when using non-ethanol fuel. I use about 500 gallons of fuel in a year, mostly on long trips. If I can save 10% of that fuel, that's 50 gallons, which equates to almost 275 pounds of carbon not released into the air. A healthy tree sequesters about 45 pounds of carbon per year. By choosing a better fuel, I reduce my carbon footprint equivalent to six growing trees. In the United States, we burn about 370 million gallons of gas per day. If we all switch to non-ethanol fuel, it would be like planting four million trees per day, every day. It's an easy way to reduce your carbon footprint and at the same time encouraging the switching of our prime farmland from ethanol to healthy corn. Shadows on the wall